What's up, fish tankers and folks? It is Point Wayne Fish Tanks, and this is a contest entry for Eric Wappa. So, it's basically just about your tank or a few tanks. So, I will probably just do this one in the video because I don't know. Maybe I'll do a few more. We'll see. But, this is my 10 gallon Molly breeding tank. You see, I got an old beta. Not very old, he's just been through a lot of crap, ghost shrimp particularly, so that's why he's all ragged looking. But I got him in here and two mollies I'm take, trying to breed. There's a female, there's a male. Starting to think they might even be different species, but we will see. And this is also a plant holding tank, so. You can see I got my little wiggier weapons, some dwarf sedge, java fern, pennywort. A mix of Ludwigian and Pennywort up here. It's floating it. So, yeah, and a moss ball. Not really in there for any reason. Just kind of there. Kind of showed in one day. Showed up. And a couple clams. Yeah. They've been in here for a long time. I was worried they would die, but I just <coughs> put some uh, fry food or crushed flake right here so it flows down. I think they catch it. And they probably also eat some other particles, but yeah, they've been doing pretty good. So yeah, this tank is kept at um, what is it, 78? No, about 80 degrees. So it is a pretty warm tank at the moment. I thought it was 78. My heater might just be a little off, so I'll have to adjust that. But yeah, this is part of my uh live bearer breeding project I am doing right now so check out the videos on that if you want to learn more about it so yeah this is my tank just planning on dirting it because it's a plant tank too so you know what why not I'll show a few more tanks breeding project related boom down here I got two female cobras uh, I bought them variated snake male get them to breed but the male died. He was just sick from the store. Always a risk of buying from PetSmart on the, the day they get the fish in. So I took that risk, bit the bullet. But the females are doing great. So what I'm thinking now that that male died, I might breed him with my cobra male, which I will show later in the video. And besides the fish, there's some pennywort. A uh, Quiet Flow 10 with some biomedia. I kind of did a modification on it. Hard to see under there. You can see a little bit of biomass in front of the cartridge. And forgot to mention this, but Aquaclear 30 up here. Foam and biological media and stuff up there. And down here's this little clip on LED. So, alright, here goes. Here I go to the Cobra tank. Or the tank with the Cobra. It's not a Cobra specific tank, but it's all male guppies. So, my room is utterly terrible. So, yeah, the light bulbs fell in the tank, so the tank is dark. But, see, there is a pretty flashy cobra male right there. Plan to breed him with females. So, alright, this is just a quick video by Fort Wayne Fish Tanks, dedicated to my boy Eric Wappa. So, alright, go check him out. I'll post a link in the description below. You rate, comment, subscribe to me, hopefully, your choice, and to Eric Wappa. He's a great guy. He's always posted on people's videos. That's how I actually found him. So, yeah, it's tank on, folks. Fort Wayne Fish Tanks. I'm signing out.